Come on, girl. explosives here, here, and here. Speed starts, charges detonate, we create a ring of fire around that hotel hotter than the devil's asshole. Which means? Castillo's forces can get out and reinforcements can get in, with Danny right in the middle. And then what? Danny kills El Presidente. It's beautiful. Hey, Danny. Danny! Look at that sexy Supremo! You want me to kill Anton Castillo? Today, Anton is giving his annual Independence Day speech at the Hotel Paraiso, live. Juan has intel on the exact location of his security detail. One in a million opportunity. We're gonna cut the head off the snake and make boots from his skin. Mierda. And you good with this? Kill a dictator who has raped our land and turned our people into slaves? Thinking about it. What about you? Never killed the president before? <laughs> It's an assassination, Danny! It's guerrilla meth! Christ, I need a shower. And you... need this. You're gonna be a fucking guerrilla legend! I'll call you! <laughs> He's too excited. He's right. Kill Castillo and Libertad will rise in the chaos. And after that, who knows? Who knows? Go put that come mierda down. Viva Libertad. Let's go, Aluso. Lara, what do you really think will happen after I kill Castillo? The generals will turn on each other. It will be civil war. Libertad will be there to pick up the pieces. It's a big risk. But I'll take it. Trigger them. You don't. Clara and I have guerrillas out planting bombs all over Esperanza. It will be a Semtex symphony. You're on the tuba, and I am the conductor. Vamos, Danny. The pinga. I can't keep up with your metaphors. Special forces. Of course. Yeah, that's identity. All requests for 
travel, both domestic and international, must be government approved. Failure to seek approval when considering travel is a criminal offense. Plan properly for a stress-free trip. Go get them! If you witness or suspect any unlawful activities during the curfew, call the PDP. Serious. Dale. Go, Luso, go. Para su seguridad, la administración de Castillo. Over here, Luso. Todos los profesores, médicos y profesionales en el país para confirmar su estado de verdadero yara.
Mandatory lockdown is in effect. By order of the... All citizens must remain in their homes. Fireworks for our anniversary. eyes on an engineer. Too late. Juan, the packages have been dropped off. You sound like a fucking postman. Just say, hey Juan, I planted the bombs. I sent you a photo of where you can find me. On my way. I'm on the rooftops in front of the hotel. If you forget what I'm like, just look for the father figure you always wish you had. I think you mean drunk uncle, Juan. Hey, I'm six hours sober. Don't jinx it. Thank you. 
down that procedure. Not to worry. I'm to destroy our I'm a good person. I follow all the rules. Just be clear and you can call the overseer. Father Garcia and her heavy terrorists oh yeah, come back. are all that stand between us and our destiny. They are thieves whose goal is simple to steal your future and leave oh, your Getting close to one. So, forget the plan or just don't care? Fuck the plan. I'm going in. Murdered, 
I was he's still giving that stupid yeah. speech. I was the man has some cojones. Yeah. Why don't you bring them to me? There was no blockade. There were no hands around our throat. The Yankees were begging to come to our island, drink our rum, dance with our women. Mi papa welcomed the world with open arms. We were not only rich, we had gold. But the fake yarns were waiting. And so I was forced to watch me papa's paradise burn. To watch me papa murdered by the terrorista revolution 1967. And then, for over 50 years, this revolution cost us our health, our pride, our hope, and left us with ghosts. I am haunted by the lessons me papa taught me as a child. The dreams he had for me, my family, my country. Before he was murdered, he used to tell me of a dream he had. A yara that was the envy of the world. A paradise that would be down for future generations. Now that I have the same dreams for my own son, Diego, I finally understand the world. You elected me to rebuild paradise. And now you, my true Yaras. To rebuild paradise is a great success. We are producing a cancer treatment. Mierda. The world is Time to catch that elevator. For. The demand for Viviro has never been high. We have already begun to construct a capital city that, that embraces our past but looks to the future. We have found a path to paradise. And yet once again, another so-called revolution, another group of terrorists, another the key? of fake Yarens, Libertad is nothing but a cancer from within who want to burn everything we've built to the ground. But now, the stakes are much higher. For the fake Yarens are not just a threat to me or you. They are a threat to Yara's very survival. When you elected me, you elected the truth. And the truth is simple. There are no second chances. Yara must produce Bibiro. More Got Bibiro the key for the than ever before. And if we allow these terroristas to distract us, there is only one destination. Failure, collapse, poverty, and our own destruction. So it is that Yara is in this state of emergency. But I promise you this. While... I'm inside. Do you see Anton? Danny? There's nobody here. Clara, I think the speech was a recording. It's a setup. Anton's soldiers are coming for you. Get out of there. You were the one who got me on that boat. You should be dead. I was the lucky one. What's your name? Danny, and you? You know who I am. You are here to kill my father. Last I checked, you were trying to get the fuck away from your papa. I shouldn't have done that. Why? Because you were the lucky one. He's a monster, Diego. He was raised that way. And you won't be? You are not going to kill me! Depends if you fire that thing again. If I run, he finds me. If he finds me, Yarens get hurt. Don't you get it? He'll never let me leave. How old are you again? Do you have family? No. 
You looking for one, Chamaco? You should leave Yara. He won't stop till all of you are gone. Mierda. Keep your head down. This way. Fucking dictators. Gracias. Hey, Danny. My papa is sick. That's why he's not here. Coño, she's beautiful. Don't mind if I do, Castillo. I made it out in one piece. Danny, what happened? How did you get out? It was a setup, but I got myself a little present. Castillo's ride. Smells like old dictator. We didn't get Castillo, but we did some damage to his regime. Damage? You punched Anton's regime in the balls today. Go buy yourself a cerveza. You earned it. Hey, you ever hear anything about Castillo being sick? No? Why? Um, uh, I overheard some guards. It's closer to a free era. Oh, I can't be. Juan? Who is this? It's Danny, Juan. Who? Danny. Danny! Do you need something? You called me. Not possible in my current state. But I'm glad you reached out. Meet me on Libertad Island immediately. Yeah? Why? One! <sighs> Shit. About time. Need you to do some dead drops for the cause. You drop off the vivido, I pick up the profits. Who are the drops for? You try these? I took one for research, now I can't stop. Turn my piss purple. You want one? No. Who's paying us for the vivido, Juan? Before we slit Castillo's throat, we should ask for more flavors. It's the Yankees. Worse. CIA. The fucking CIA is in bed with Libertad? What's Clara think of this? 
Well, if she knew, I would hope it'd be something like, Thanks, Juan. I'm so happy to have guns to kill fascists named Castillo. Etc., etc. Freedom costs money. Clara doesn't ask. And I'll never tell. It's a private club. Just you, me, and lighthouses filled with Anton's candy. Clara needs to stay shiny for the people. You're protecting her. I'm not so sure I'm the only one looking out for Clara. Just remember, after La Revolución, she won't have time for a guerrilla like you. Just in case. That's the spirit, guerrilla. I say yes, I feel like you are still going to tell me. Fucking drug lords want to stash their cash in American real estate so they can launder it. Fifty million dollar deal, Danny. That's great, Juan. I even got them to throw in a few kilos of product. Sold it on the black market, but... Lost it all at the tables in Monte Carlo. How is this helping me right now? Nah, I get lonely. Suerte! Thank you. Ningún problema. Hola. Go, Luso, go. Over here, Luso. One down.
First package dropped off. Okay, good. Hey, did I tell you about the time I brokered a deal for Gorbachev? Let me guess. You made the deal. Took a cut for yourself. Lost it in a dumb bet you can't even remember? I mean... Yes? I think this means we are family. Hola. I had hope for Clara, but I got you. You thought I wouldn't notice Libertad selling my Viviro to the Yankees? You're a dead man! When the Garillas arrested my family in 67, me, Papa, was dragged to this very cell. I was put in the cell next door. Thirteen. Like you, mijo. We used to talk every single night through this vent. I loved it. His voice taught me to be strong, to be a man. And then the Garillas came. Every day I'm in charge. Oh. Yeah. Ah! Crime by crime, piece by piece, he paid to the Garillas. But we were still talk every single night. <laughs> Until they took his tongue for his last to Yara. Stop! 
Papa, stop this! Who is this girl here to you? Ah. I think we should skip a few steps, Raoul. Viva Libertad. The attack. The Hotel Paraiso. Danny was there. You... You told me that you hid in the tunnel. Danny could have killed me. Could have given me to Libertad. We have no time for lies. I've stopped running. I've listened. I've learned. I've done everything you have asked. I will be El Presidente. Let Danny go. I am not a monster, Diego. We will give them a chance. Keep moving, Danny. Diego, not fucking right. Okay, Clara, shoot. No, not like this. Come find me at the Esperanza School for the Lost. I think you know the place. Yeah, you could say that. On my way. Danny, make sure you're alone. No Juan. This is just you and me. Juan, we're burned. Castillo was waiting. He and his fucking general tried to kill me. Glad you made it. I, uh... I have to ask. Did you talk, Danny? Not a fucking word. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. The kid, Diego, he saved my life. What? Shot Anton's general dead. All the... Binga. This is good. This is very good. We are playing 4D chess in space now, Danny. 
Fuck your 4D chess one. I just got my molars ripped out. Same thing happened to me back in the Congo. Except I did it to myself. Just chew in the front, like a rabbit. And Juan, let's leave Clara out of it. We got burned. That's all she needs to know. Clara's not enough to fucking deal with, let alone you almost getting torn to pieces. Gracias. Esperanza School for the Lost. Full circle, eh, Clara? What are you doing? It's my papa's. I borrowed it. Ya tu sabe. I'm done, Talia. No more secret meetings. No more protests. No more friends that just disappear. He's too strong. So you're gonna just march into the Capitolio and put daddy's gun to Castillo's head? No. I'm going to build an army. And then I'm going to put Castillo in the ground. Come with me. You don't think I can do it? I've seen this, Talia. I've dreamed it. My mama used to tell me, save the dreams for the rich, fair-skinned Yarens. Us? We don't get to dream. We survive. You're not going to free Yara by killing Castillo, rich girl. You have to convince Yara it wants to be free. For all of us. Clara. Clara. You wanna tell me why you dragged me back to my old orphanage? He's losing, Danny. Soon we march on the Capitolio. And now, Castillo wants to meet. You're joking, right? I want to know what you think. You've been face to face. 
I think Castillo's always two steps ahead. And he's not going to stop unless we put a bullet in his skull. <laughs> and then what? We kill his kid too? You had your chance. Why didn't you do it? Juan had solid intel there was a Castillo up in that hotel. He just had the wrong one. You let his kid live, and then Castillo lets you walk away from a death sentence. But the thing is, Danny, you were right. If Yara is going to have a future, his people, our people, we need to coexist. And the point was never to kill Castillo. It was to free Yara. For all of us. You had already made up your mind, hadn't you? Yara needs a leader, Clara. Not a martyr. Viva Libertad, Danny. What the hell is going on, Juan? It's Clara. J Go on, you just get there. This is D-Day, Danny. Fucking D-Day. Fuck.
Hell of a view. Too bad the Capitolio building ruins Esperanza. <laughs> <laughs> 